things are about to get loud, things are about to get quick. As Nick said, the fastest teams in the world right now are here for our Flyball Final. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, the louder you cheer, the faster these dogs will go. Who will be our fly ball champions? Let's start by bringing out our judge. She's been fantastic all weekend. Ladies and gentlemen, a big round of applause for Jenny Knight. So our judge will be keeping an eye on proceedings. I'm also told that she's even got her own hashtag on social media. She's been that popular. Ladies and gentlemen, hashtag Judge Jenny is in the building. All right, so we're just getting the course ready. It is so, so loud backstage. These dogs are raring to go. We're going to be feeling the adrenaline. Remember to cheer on your favorite team. Who will be the Fly Ball Champions? This is going to get exciting. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are ready to bring out our teams. First up, please welcome Focus. They are going to be battling out. And well, here we go. It is the agility finals there. day. Four teams have made it through from the 16 that started. So we had six of the ten fastest in Europe at the start. I can remember hearing conversations on Thursday. Goodness news, goodness knows who's going to win. What we all do now, it's going to be very, very fast indeed. And the record that we came here was 15 seconds 20. It has been broken nine times. The first of the finals, Molten Magnets, very much the outsiders, just delighted to be here. In fact, a bit amazed to have reached the final against Focus, the holders. Then Road Runners beat beat, absolutely brilliant from Belgium. First overseas combination here, new record holders against the Aces. Ready and, on the boxes. And then we will have the grand final. Box judges. Jenny Knight, on the line. our judge. Yeah. This is going to be a practice run. The Molten Magnets uh, from Northamptonshire. Inca, Jackson, Fletcher, Dexter and Mason and Bailey, there, dogs. You want to say something about the boxes before we start? About the right? boxes, Jim. Yeah, you'll see the dog has to hit the front of the box and take the ball out of it. The ball is put in there by the box loader. The dog must take the ball out of that box. These boxes are the personal property of the clubs. They're built within certain specifications, but they then are their own. And there we see a number of different holes, and I'll explain a bit more about that uh, in just a minute. We are all set. It is Molten Magnets from Molten on the red on the far side. Hot favourites in the blue on the near. Focus, the holders of the Cruft Championship. The Friday and Saturday champions focus. First time they've ever broken the 15-second barrier as well. That's a huge barrier in the world of flyball. Focus in the blue on the near side, and Focus are away very, very quickly with Diesel. Next to go for Focus is Mouse. It's with Focus on the near side at the moment. Fletcher battling away to get back on the far side. Can I? Has it though for Focus on the near, and then a quick turn from Panic on the near side. It's going to go Focus's way. It is indeed. This one's gone to form. Focus's way. Molten, molten Magnets. Great flyball racing, great flyball racing. I think Focus have got a bit more to come, looking at the, some of their uh, changeovers. They've got more to make up there, Jim. Well, Molten Magnets on the far side, big outsiders. They're running for their founder, Gene Meeking. Qualified from Chavaris last year. There were tears when they qualified. They're used to running against quicker teams, but they know the Magnets, they've got to do something, they've got to make something stick to stay alive now. It's again with focus on this near side. Very quick opening dog is Diesel. Then Mouse again for focus, still with focus on the near side. There goes Kenai for focus, looking good for focus right now, and it will be completed with panic. And that 
let's focus through to the final I would imagine we just look for confirmation it comes indeed from Jenny Knight yeah, focus through to the final. Ryan Haywood, Kim Gillespie, Jaco Jensen, Craig Burrows, Justin Turing, and Gary Manneking, their team captain, Samantha Haywood, and box loader, Rachel Manneking, as anticipated, Graham. This place is absolutely rocking, Jim. I just wish you at home could actually pick up the atmosphere that's going on there. 2-0 to focus. Total respect there to Molten Magnus. On another day, uh, another competition, they could easily be the winners. But the, the, the standard, Jim, this year is just awesome. So we will see focus once again. And we move focus, go through, Magnus go home. side a little bit rusty aces high they've had precious little running in two and a half years ready on boxes box judges ready on the line <laughs> We are all set now. It is the second race on finals day. Aces high in the blue on the near side and on the far side. And they are off and running on the near side in that practice run for Aces high. A practice here, of course, as anticipated. Aces high then. Who have done really, really well to get here after lacking a little bit of uh, race practice and in the red on that far side well the road runners are from belgium absolutely outstanding first ever overseas team to reach here thursday's champions runners up yesterday broke the record and they keep that that new record at 1484. ready on the boxes box judges Ready on the line. It is aces high, the 2019 champions in the blue on the near side, a little bit undercooked against the brilliant Belgians. Roadrunners beat beat Zon from Zonhoven in the northeast corner of Belgium. Absolutely outstanding. First overseas team to reach across the champions on Thursday. Runners up yesterday and new record holders as well with 1484. First of the best of three races. On the near side, it is with aces high at the moment, but the Belgians stretching away there with set, such a quick opening dog. Then tantrum for the Belgians on that far side. It is with it is with the Belgians on the far side. There's also a fault on the near side as well. And a little uh, hustle coming through on the near, but that will go beep beep's way. Roadrunners beep beep on that far side. A crossover fault here, Graham. There we are. Yeah, clearly crossover fault there, which has cost them the leg. But uh, this Belgium team are a class act, and of course they have to push the changeovers to the absolute limit if they want to be in with a chance. So the 2019 champions, aces high, have to win this, otherwise their crop is owner is over. The Belgians, who are loving the atmosphere, they've never experienced anything like this. They know if they win again, they will be into the final. It is the Roadrunners on the red on that far side. Aces high in the blue on the near. Helen Knight calling best of order. We are ready. The Roadrunners one to the good on that far side. They are very, very, very smartly with Sep. Sep has it at the moment. Second dog goes. That is Vito on the far side then uh, for, for the Belgian. It's very much with that red far side at the moment. But here comes the little whipping hustle. Doing everything, little hustle. Trying to make it hustle. Eight years of age. Couldn't do it. The Belgians go through and they go through to the final. Great final effort from Hustle and uh, Aces High. 14.76 is that time. 14.76.
So we have a new record again. The record goes for the tenth time here at Crufts. What an awesome final we have building up for us now. But the road runners beat beat from the northeast corner of Belgium will take some catching. Fantastic. And to get the record go again, I mean, we've had it gone so many times, Jim, I'm having trouble keeping up here. They are getting ever closer to the European record, which currently stands at 14.53. All right, we move on. We are now going to do the third and fourth place runoff. So we first of all welcome back the Molten Magnets and the Aces. So the Aces are going to stay where they are. Molten Magnets on this near side in the blue. This is the third and fourth place runoff. And I think we're going to go straight into it. No warm up this time, says our judge. Ready on the boxes, box judges. Ready on the line. We're going to see the runoff here now for third and fourth place. Molten magnets and uh, aces high. Aces high on that near side, and it's just with aces high at the moment to try and to get third place. Aces high have it uh, at the moment, and molten magnets, as anticipated, done so well to reach the last four. The Molten Magnets of Inca, Jackson, Fletcher and Dexter finding the pace a little bit too hot to handle, but I cannot underestimate what a fantastic achievement it is for the Magnets to get here, Graham. It is, well, it's a, it's a testament to all of them for getting here, Jim, um, but they have done exceptionally well. Ace is high than the 2019 champions. You never know, this could be the last little view of hustle uh, that we get here. Absolute favourite, a bit of a legend in the whole world of flyball hustle. Eight years of age, expected to run the last leg for Aces High. So the Aces one to the good on the Magnets. It is the Aces on the near side. Can the Magnets pull something out of the fire? Just with the Aces at the moment in the blue. Second Aces dog is, is away. That is Rampage. They have it at the moment on this near side. There's a fault on the far side as well. And here comes the hustler. And there's a fault on the near side as well. They're going to have to run again. The little hustle, he's going to have to run again. And there's a fault on the near. And they have pulled one round. Those magnets, they always compete against stronger teams. They pulled one round and gone for a decider, Graham. They do. They just keep going. They keep going and just uh, let the other people make the mistake. We had a crossover fault on the far side there. And another crossover fault. What's going on, Jim? So, one each. We have a decider again. The 2019 champions. Faces high. Against Molten Magnus, based in Molten, in nearby North Hampshire. This one decides who's going to be third, who's going to be fourth at Cross 2022. Full house, packed house, lots of noise, lots of lights, lots of warmth, and they're away and running. Magnets on the far side, training at the moment. Quick uh, second goal for Rampage going for Aces High. Now it's Riot for Aces High, and they have it at the moment. Go on, my hustler. Go on, the hustler. The hustler brings them home. There's a fault on the far side as well. So pleased to see the hustle on a winning note. Well done, those magnets, though, from Northamptonshire. Absolutely sensational achievement. A, to reach Crufts, and B, to reach the last day. But Aces High will finish in the top three. You know, well done to Aces High. But I say hats off to uh, Bolton Magnet. They just had to go for it in the end, and that's exactly what they did, and that's the spirit that we want. Also, huge, huge thank you to our judge Jenny, who's doing a fantastic job here this weekend. 
Keeping us in order, absolutely. Right, are we ready for the final, We started and with 16 on Thursday. We are now down to the final. last two. The Crufts record has been broken ten Focus. times. It Up could well go again here. The first overseas team to reach Crufts are here and have to be the slight favourites. In the red, on the far side, Roadrunners beep beep from Zonhoven in Belgium. On the near side, Focus, the holders, Friday and Saturday champions. They've crashed through that 15-second barrier. First time they've ever broken it. And they want to do it again, and they know they face the ultimate test right now against Roadrunners Beep Beep. Flyball World Cup coming up later this year in Belgium. What's occurring there, Graham? Well, we're obviously using rubber matting for the safety of the dogs, um, and its safety is utmost, and it's started to just come up a bit, so you can see the guys there working frantically. We started with 16, now we are down to the last two. The fly ball record here at Crufts has gone ten times and counting. It has been a sensational competition. It is a full house again. Ready on the box, The please. last two. Focus, Ready the holders, the based in Selby, against the brilliant Belgians, road runners, beep, beep, here for the first time. Breaking records along the way. Focus have crashed through the 15-second barrier for the first time as well. We are off and running here then. And on the red on that far side, it's very, very close. We're looking to the Belgium. It's so close, you can hardly call it at the moment. And it's just going to go the Belgians' way, I think, on that far side to beat beat. Fine run by that uh, Belgian uh, first dog set, setting them underway. Vito. Dragon. And, and a new 14, record, Jim. 7 1. I can't believe this, that record tumbling away again. 14 7 1, Graham. A fast, furious fun. You just cannot believe what's happening. Do not move anybody. Just stay in front of that TV. This is just brilliant. So now we look at focus. We look at a champion's response. Can they strike back? This Belgian team, absolutely outstanding. Focus under pressure. Can they handle the pressure? Is the title going overseas for the very first time? We're about to find out. Diesel, Mouse, Can I and Panic to go for Focus in the blue on the near side. Flying start on the far though by Sip. There's a false start on the far side. Sep got away too quickly. So if Focus keep it clean, we're going to have a run off here. Looking good on the near side. Our Focus at the moment, they just have to keep it clean. And the judge, Jenny Knight, will point our way. And it'll be one apiece. It's one apiece. We have a decider in the final. Could go any way at all, Graham. Push. And this was a false start. You can't go through the timing gates until the lights have gone green. And they're just pushing. They just want to try and shave another fraction off this turn. But they've collected a fault, so it's now one all. This is what we come down to, the decider. After an absolute thrilling few days of flyball racing. Listen to the noise, listen to the atmosphere, not a seat to be had. The Ronan is from Belgium, off slowest this time. And there's a false on the near side start this time. So this is in the Belgians' hands if they keep it clean. Focus making a really crucial false start on the near side. And I think it's going to go overseas, you know. They are celebrating. Beep, 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 beep. They have done it. They've qualified for Crufts. They have won Crufts. Roadrunners from Zonhoven in Belgium have dethroned the reigning champions and have broken records along the way as well. Great to see them here. Look what that means. And they said they could not believe the atmosphere. They couldn't believe the crowds. They couldn't believe the reception that they have got. But Dave Maris... Stin Bunin, Gert Jan Lehmans, Melanie Steeman, Wesley Verderels, and Didier van der Hayden.
They've come here along with Dave Maris, who set the team, and Trump. Look at these pitches, crucial. and Focus knew they had to get a really good start here. The dog went through the timing gates before it turned green, and that's what's cost them the championship, but they will say that they went down fighting. Fantastic pitches here, great camaraderie between the two teams, great respect, uh, and this is the best fly ball competition I think I've ever, ever witnessed, Jim. And well done to Focus as well. They knew they had their hands full uh, uh, with, with those Belgians, with, with the Roadrunners. And they will come back to fight another day for sure. The Flyball Champions 2022 Roadrunners, big, big, everybody! Roadrunners, beep, beep. They'll be celebrating all the way back to Zonhoven for sure. They just cannot believe the look of incredulity almost uh, on their faces. Special mention for team captain Dave Maris, who has done so much to uh, form this team, to get them together, formed uh, eight years ago. Absolutely outstanding. And record breakers as well along the way. The Crofts record has been absolutely smashed. Is it 11 times? Is it 12 times? Um, I'm not sure. But again, looking across to, to Focus, who had real problems um, with all their preparation. Yeah, <laughs> we can see you, don't worry. And uh, Friday and Saturday champions, Focus, you can't ask much more from that. The holders as well wanted it absolutely big time. And they will be back for sure. We'll focus. As Graham said, there's huge camaraderie between these teams, and no, they know that they have been part of something very special. I'll go as far as to say in fly ball history here at Crofts 2022. And nowhere in the world the competitors say to me, do you get an atmosphere like this for fly ball? Congratulations to Crofts and everyone concerned for giving us an outstanding fly ball competition. And there we are. Aces High receiving their third place rosettes. Yeah, well, I can't wait for next year. I just, just already, I'm anticipating Flyball Crofts 2023. Yep, uh, Aces High, you remember, held the, the, the Flyball record coming here at 1520, and they will go away and regroup and look to break that formidable 15 second barrier. An excellent for the Magnets from Northamptonshire. Hats off to them, really, really good, and running for the founder, uh, Gene Meakin, and Gene would have been outstandingly proud of all their achievements today. Great to see them here, great to see them back at Crofts, and uh, what a fine effort to reach the last four.